Hello Bakers and welcome to the Dev Couch, another episode on the Upside Down channel. Today we are checking two softwares. First one is going to be very useful if you are a beginner into the 3D world and you want quickly to start creating some models and as well it's completely free. And no, I'm not talking about Blender, this is something which is very very simple and it's just meant for really really new users just so that they can jump into the 3D world. It's a great place in my opinion to get you started and interested in becoming a 3D artist. The second software we are talking about is going to be especially useful for everyone that's doing concept art. So without further ado, smash a like and subscribe to my channel so that you can help me out. And now let's start the video. The first software that I mentioned is called Dust3D. It's completely free to use software and you can find a download link in the description below. The developers of Dust3D have received an Epic grant for their work, so Epic Games are really supporting this new adventure. The software's logic for modeling and creating assets is a little bit different from what we are usually used to see, but for some of you that are familiar with ZBrush, you can find some logic which is very close to the Z spheres. Once you started adding a little bit more geometry into your scene, the software and some of your assets touch each other, the software automatically calculates and combines them together. You can see that the interface is very simple and it's not even close of being intimidating like some of the other 3D softwares out there. I'm talking about you Houdini. Talking about learning new skills and developing personal projects, I want to remind you about Upside Downs Reddit. There you can find some of the latest news which I'm going to also cover here on the channel. And as well you can post some of your artwork, game or project that you are working on and get some awesome feedback either from the community or have a review here on the channel. So go check Upside Downs Reddit, follow it and get some awesome feedback on your artwork. The second software that we are talking today is something which is going to be very useful for all the concept artists, but not only because it's something which you can use for learning and studying and developing your skills. I'm talking about Anatomy 360. It's a software which you can pose characters or edit them and so on and so on. And after that, play some lights, place them in a different light scenarios, edit the lights, edit the scene around them and so on and get a very good reference for your work. This is something which is very useful if you're a concept artist because you can place characters into a different positions and all of them can have exactly the same type of light source which is going to make your work much faster and easier. Another thing is that you can also use it as a reference so you can put something on the screen and as well draw it and this way you can improve your skills without the need of having, for example, a wooden dummy or something like this. There is a free version which you can download and start using it, but if you would like to get some of the more juicy and interesting features, you will need to buy the software. Thank you for joining me in today's episode of Dev Couch. Subscribe to the channel, leave a like and a comment down below. See you next time.